awkward. That was a that was a replay just a second ago. Unsportsmanlike against Las Vegas, I believe, at the end of the play. So that so the um, okay, we'll, we'll we'll sort that out in just a second. Draw play. Harris to the ten, stopped by Owe. Third and goal. So Kansas City with the football back after their defensive front turned away the Colts on fourth and short. It's third and 13 for Mahomes on the ensuing possession. Mahomes, kind of a sidearm three-quarter delivery, gets his man, Juju Smith-Schuster, down the sideline. And that's a big chunk play there. And I bet you I bet you that was one of those awesome angle, if you see it from the other opposite uh, end zone angle one of those special Mahomes throws who goes now to the conventional run play while Mac Jones takes a deep drop throws to the corner of the end zone and the Ravens defender is there oh the air the throw was off and Marlon Humphrey is there for the interception the Ravens defense comes up with the turnover to bail out Lamar Jackson and Rashad Bateman who fumbled for the Ravens just two minutes prior my goodness trying to give his guys a chance being aggressive but not not reckless that was a little bit reckless right there and has that velocity and that's usually because he's looking off someone else so that he can get a ball over there second and seven going to the end zone and off the hands of Kelsey who can't believe he didn't catch it well this is the same route they scored on earlier almost the same play but this time Okereke doesn't go inside right the play in the first half to score the first touchdown he stayed inside, he gets outside leverage, and it makes the pass have to be back shoulder. And Kelsey knows that wasn't that hard of a catch. It was a perfect throw back shoulder. Third and seven. Can the Colts hold him to a field goal? Now they haven't blitzed at all, I don't think. Do they do it here? No, they gotta hold up. They got a flag. They got Mahomes wrapped up. There's going to be a late hit on Mahomes. You can't do that. <laughs> I'll protect Mahomes in some ways because it might be a face mask. <laughs> but you had what looked like a holding call first. And I think we're going to have offsetting. I'm always for the quarter. Matt Ryan's over there. I'm like, I'm going to protect Matt Ryan. Mahomes right at the end. Looks like maybe a hold on a face mask. Two offsetting, right? Yep. It's just a hole. What's the question? Oh. Whoops. <laughs> Holding. Offense number 77. Yeah. That penalty is declined. Yeah, so Sean Smith, they had the holding call, but Mahomes wanted a face mask, and we thought we saw that too in the Red Zone Studio as a tough run goes into the end zone. That's Alexander Madison. Boy, the, the, the Viking running backs changing their numbers here coming into uh, 2022. Madison breaks through for it. Cook. Uh, Dalvin Cook, by the way, not in on that play because Cook is out of the game. We saw him going to the medical tent with what looked to be like a hand or wrist area injury. So Madison, a fine backup running back in his own right, pops in for the touchdown that makes that a one-possession game in Minnesota. This kick is no good. And they should have. You're right. The confidence is dwindling. So, right Matt Amendola, the backup kicker, in because Harrison Butker's been injured the last two weeks. Shaq Leonard, formerly Darius Leonard, with the celebration on the sideline. Two miscues on field goal formations for Kansas City in the fourth quarter. A missed fake field goal that they didn't get and then a missed kick wide left they could be up by two possessions at this time Daniel Carlson can he do his job and make this a one possession game for Vegas he does indeed 35 yarder is through it's an eight point game with three and a half minutes remaining in that one and Buffalo finds themselves trailing for the first time in quite some time maybe the first time today I don't think Miami ever had the lead in this game it was 14 14 at the half 14 14 through most of the third quarter Buffalo had it this is Miami's first lead of the day in the battle of unbeatens we talked to Christian the other day well Baker comes out of that pile with the ball Looks like his left shoulder's hanging low. Wilkins and Allen jawing back and forth at each other. Where they are. 
And Greg Mans has come out on the field, another lineman. Allen was hot. Somebody well, did that, something. So Wilkins did something. There's stuff that happens that in those Allen, piles that we don't want to know. <laughs> there, there's a lot that goes on in those bobs or piles. Bob you you know. Oh, you yeah. Know. oh yeah. Yes. <laughs> so Wilkins. Uh, and Wilkins still drawing at Allen. It does give Allen each team. <laughs> While they're sorting that out, we'll tell you what it is when they announce the flag. Lamar Jackson. Good pass protection on that one for the Ravens. Goes to the tight end, Mark Andrews, who's having himself a day. Sixth catch for Andrews. He has 72 yards and two touchdowns, does the tight end. Uh, actually, make it 80 yards, I guess, on the on the uh, total for the day for Andrews as we update the stats there. That pass play went for 25 yards and a first down Baltimore. The Indianapolis Colts trying to pull off what would be a massive upset if they can get a fourth quarter touchdown here. Frank Wright guys would take the lead. Here is fourth and one. They've had fourth and short multiple times in this game today and have gone for it. They've made some. Actually, no, they haven't. They're 0 for 2 on fourth down. Here comes fourth and one. Blitz off the slot on Matt Ryan. We tried to pass. They stopped him on the fourth down on the short yardage. Right here, you're going to see everyone down. No safeties are deep. All out pressure. You can throw this ball anywhere downfield or quarterback sneak it for the first down. Well, I, I think right there, you go for that, don't you? Man, I'm not at all. You, they, you got Mahomes on the other side. You're going to give it back to him with six minutes and change. You may never see it again. Never. And you got to trust getting the yard, even though we have it today. Isn't it funny? Taylor couldn't get the short yardage, but Matt Ryan yeah. can. That's right. <laughs> the one time you're able to convert on fourth and one, you let, you let Matt Ryan do it. And they here comes a third and eight for the Ravens. The Foxborough faithful trying to cheer their defense on to a stop. When he first came onto the field, Dietrich Wise was really controlling that side, but they've really kind of got that controlled and settled down. Patriots bring an extra man. Jackson to the outside and incomplete with a coverage from Jack Jones on to Marcus Robinson. Patriots defense comes up with another stop. Here comes the punt team. Hopefully it's just defense does its job in New England. Injury, another offensive lineman injured for Buffalo. We've seen a couple of those big guys go out. Buffalo is playing today on defense without five starters. But they've done a reasonably good job against what had been an explosive Dolphins offense in the first two weeks of the season. Second and 25. What do you call here? throw it out there but then it all kind of fell apart and Allen decided to run and try and get a couple yards and that's when things happened with Ian Wilkins and it's a pass and it's caught by Diggs he'll dance and he's got blockers including Singletary and Davis finally brought down by Duke Riley he takes it on the catch and run to the 37 of 16 back to Jane communication has been poor all day they have not got guys blocked up the middle and off the edge Let's watch who the center points at, who Matt Ryan points to. He points out right. He's sending the center to the right. Back is asking left guard. He's like, you got to go over here. We're over here. We got this guy. We just saw it. He might have the communication down. Here he goes. Needs to get to the 45 for a first. They're on him again. Still up, but not for long. Back at the 30. It's Cook first, then Bolton. Wow. We went through. Uh, we're not cutting back to the Bills Dolphins game. There's an injury timeout. One of the Bills, actually, it's Stephon Diggs, appears to be cramping up leg cramps, apparently, for Diggs on the sideline. At least that's the medical attention, it's similar to what you would see bending the toe back to try and uh, elongate the muscles. Okay, the Lions with the lead trying to run out the clock here, or at least get a good time consuming drive. We'll call a timeout at the five minute mark. So, again, Bill's Dolphins game has come to a stop just for a moment. We'll get you back there in Miami in a moment. Justin Fields, and oh boy. It's still a tie game, but Fields, every time we cut to him, it's been it's been rough. He's been sacked five times. He's thrown two interceptions, but it's still a 20-20 game. Okay, Stephon Diggs has been helped to the sideline there. Again, just seemed like a cramp, nothing serious for Diggs, but he's not in the lineup at the moment. Rolling and throwing Singletary, a career day catching. Banged out of bounds, downfield he goes near the 41. A catch and run of 24 on third and 10. Holland the hit, first and 10, Buffalo. 
Josh Allen probably here in New England. Here's Patriots on a third down, and we'll get you right back to the Bills in a moment. Patriots bring, or Ravens bring some pressure. Jones beats it with a straight tackle. Knocked out from behind. Ball to the sideline. Was he in bounds? Yes, he was. Kyle Hamilton, the rookie, knocks it out. Coming from the top. Number 15, Nelson Aguilar gets back inside. Another great throw right there, but great hustle. We're going to double box this in to show you the replay. Did the defender stay in bounds on the recovery? Ooh, Marcus Peters right on the sideline. They're going to call it a recovery. On the right side of your screen, first down was a two-yard loss for the Bills. Stephon Diggs is back in the lineup after getting some fluids on the sideline. Second and 12 in Miami. Josh Allen, time to throw, checks it down underneath. That's a modest gain to get the lost yardage back and then some third and medium coming up for the Bills. Great camera angle there. Is there anything to determine if Marcus Peters had a body part out of bounds as he recovered the fumble, which was a, a third down conversion and then some for New England. Oh, dramatic change of events if this stands true in Baltimore for Baltimore and it does there's Lamar Jackson under center so they're going to throw for it here with five and a half minutes left Lamar takes a shot Mark Andrews they had connected on that same exact play a minute ago we'll watch that Baltimore game for you but this is the drama at the moment they're down in three they're coming after him he dumps it off it's caught by Moss who gets down to the 28 he's got the first down on the Bills are on the move. They need a touchdown to take the lead. The Lions have the lead, trying to work the clock. But it's third down with five minutes remaining. Amon Ross, St. Brown. The kid has a nose to get open and a nose for the sticks. Second-year player with another catch, his sixth of the day, goes for a first down Detroit. They will continue to work the clock, and Minnesota will start considering using their timeouts. Ten different receivers for Allen. Cook is in. First and ten and offsides of the Andrew. And Allen's going, wait, that's a free down. That's <laughs> well, a Allen, free down. Allen wanted the free play, but Ingram was on side. They're, they're going to stop it. number six unabated to the quarterback. There you go, unabated. Indianapolis.